99% of guys don't know how to style their hair, so I'm trying to fix that problem. The truth is, you can really improve your looks just by knowing the proper way to style your hair. And today, I wanna show you how easy it is. This is how I style mine every day. I'm in between haircuts at the moment, my fringe is about five inches long, my sides are about two inches long, and one to two inches in the back. Getting longer, the higher you go. Here are the easy steps that I take to get my hair styled to look like this in less than 10 minutes. Because I'll be using a hair dryer, I'll first apply a few drops of a heat protectant so there's no damage done to my hair. I use the Forte Series Hydrating Oil every single day. A few drops of this and your hair will immediately feel softer, healthier, and smell incredible. But most importantly, it'll be safe from heat damage. Then I use what's called a pre-styler. A pre-styler is a product that is applied before you style your hair. The thickening spray is great for guys who have thin hair, so your hair looks nice and full. Just spread it through your hair from roots to ends after you shower. Here are the tools that I recommend. A blow dryer and a brush. That is it. You can go for a round brush with board bristles or a vented brush, which is probably the easiest one to use. And yes, this is our new vented brush launching today, which I'm very excited for. I love that it's still rounded, it has extra long bristles, and it's vented from the head all the way down to the handle for extra airflow when you're blow drying. And for our New Year special, if you buy three or more products, you get 10% off your order plus the brush absolutely free. I'll leave the link to that below. Just use the hair dryer and brush to start shaping your wet hair. Think of it this way. Your hair will typically stay in the shape that it was dried in. That's why I like to brush and dry it upwards at the same time. That gives my hair the shape and the height that I want to end up with. Up top, I want to create more height. On the sides, I want it more compact, more sleek, less volume. The rounded brush is a little more advanced and good for guys who want to add waves to their hairstyle. The vented brush is easier to use and more versatile and lets you style your hair any way you want. You can see that I twist the brush to pull the hair as I dry it. It will feel awkward at first, but within a few tries, you're gonna get much, much better. Take it from someone who hated hair dryers at first, just because I didn't know what I was doing. Also, in case you don't have a brush, you can definitely just use your fingers. It'll just be a bit more loose, not as clean cut, but it works. Once your hair is fully dry, it's time to apply a styling product to hold it in place. Today, I'm using the Control Clay. It has medium to high hold, it's easy to use, and washes off very easily. Emulsify it into your palms, then start applying to your hair from the back first. Now, we do that to make sure that no clumps of products are visible in the front, where it would just mess up your hairstyle completely. Slowly move to the front, then make sure to get the sides. I like to sleek my sides down to minimize that poofiness on the sides. Once you have your desired hairstyle, you can either leave it as is or since I'll be outdoors all day, I'm spraying the freeze spray to really lock in this hairstyle. This isn't moving or going anywhere. If you want to know the best hairstyles of 2023, watch this video on your screen and also let me know which hairstyle I should go for next. And don't forget to check out ForteSeries.com for the best men's hair products in the market. I promise we won't let you down.